Prior to the European invasion, the natives of the Southwest lived in relative peace. There was conflict between the tribes during scarcity, but here at Pecos and El Norte, there was a yearly trade which was known as the Rendezvous. The Plains natives would come in from all over to trade furs, tools, and meat for agricultural products, pottery, and other items. They didn't know war, at least not as it related to Europe. The first non-native to step foot into New Mexico was not a Spaniard. He wasn't even European. He was a North African Moor by the name of Estebanico. In 1539, he led a Spanish expedition into New Mexico looking for the seven cities of gold. He met his demise at Zuni Pueblo, where he was chopped up into pieces. The rest of his party returned without ever entering the Pueblo. But as the sun set on the adobe and straw walls, it looked like it had a golden hue, so they reported that the legends were true. There were cities made of gold, and this was the beginning of the end, as life as the natives knew it. When the Spanish returned to New Mexico in 1540, it was in full force. The first major conflict between the explorers and the natives was in 1599 at Acoma Pueblo. Spanish explorer Añate's own nephew lost his life in this battle. <laughs> 